It's a tradition going strong for 66 years. The best recent high school graduates from Vermont and New Hampshire meeting up for the annual Shrine Maple Sugar Bowl. It's a battle for twin state dominance, but more importantly, played to benefit the children of Shriners Hospitals. And 72 players were chosen from Vermont and New Hampshire. The players representing their hometowns and their states as a whole, but rivalries are set aside to come together and benefit children in need. And halfway through the first, New Hampshire's Cody Potter in at QB, but he gets it done with his feet to cruise into the end zone. New Hampshire up 7-zip after the extra point, and the Granite State takes a 7-3 lead into halftime. And that score holds up into the fourth. New Hampshire's Cameron Mann sneaks past a few green jerseys and pad that lead just a bit. It's 14-3. But only a minute later, it's Vermont on the move. Rutland's Ryan Moore buys himself a little time with the scramble and then throws one deep. Jake Baker fights off the defender to make the catch and motor into the end zone. Vermont cuts the lead to 14-9, but the comeback bid falls just short. New Hampshire tacks on one more TD for good measure, and the Granite State takes this one 21-9. My dad and my grandpa are both with the Shriners, so it meant a lot being able to play this game for the kids and raise all that money. It feels it feels awesome being able to bring this W back to New Hampshire, as well as playing for my high school coaches go out with that W. And with the win, New Hampshire snaps a three-year Vermont win streak and moves up to 48-16-2 in the all-time series.